Uh, we've gotten a lot of questions on the boom mat in this Jeep, and that was what we used to spray in for like a bed liner in the floor. So y'all stay tuned and we'll get right into this video. I don't like cabbage. I don't like cabbage. It's a 16 inch fan. We're gonna mount it up. We're in a uh, temperature switch. Relay. You keep wiping the Jeep. Yeah, you just sweating on everything. The whole floor over here. I can't set that <laughs> Okay, control. we didn't have to move the exhaust. We didn't have to jack up. We didn't have to do anything. Look at that. <laughs> Boom mat. And is it a good solution for floors? What does it do? Is there any downsides to it and things like that? So as you can see on this floor, the boom mat is still there. And it's pretty sturdy. So it's not gonna stand up to throwing tools on it and stuff, but you're wearing shoes and stuff, it's gonna be fine. Now as far as dirt, this is mud. I mean, well actually oil kind of. Why do you spill, spill all over here? But still doing good. Scrape off all of that and just comes off right there. So it does seem like a good solution for just uh, if you pull out your carpet to keep, well, prevent rust and things like that. It does not insulate against heat. So if you want to something that's especially in Florida or Texas or some other really hot states, you're driving down the road, your floor is going to get hot and your AC isn't going to be able to compensate for it that well. Uh, as far as when it gets hot, my wife says it leaves a kind of a, a black film on her feet. So our intent for this is to go back over this with carpet. So that would add the, uh, the noise insulation, which it does do that very well. It sounds dead. So it's got that dead knock sound. And uh, we're gonna put some insulation over the top of that, which will further deaden it. And then we'll put carpet. And uh, so that will help with the AC working and also keep uh, the heat down in the summertime. In the wintertime it's fine. The heater in the Jeep keeps up with uh, the coldness of the floor with no problem. Plus you're usually wearing heavier clothes at that time as well. Well not in Florida because it is uh, January and it's 70. The boom mat, I would recommend it for sound deadening because as you heard I was knocking on the metal and it didn't have any ringing. It was kind of a thud. So that is a good thing. We are going back with carpet on this because, well, our son is going back with carpet on this because he says during the Florida summers, it's a little too warm. That road heat coming up. Against our judgment, we don't think he needs to go back with carpet because he likes to go into sand a lot. And also when it rains and it gets in there, water. No. His last carpet molded. I don't know why he wants to do this. But anyways. Well, and also there was rust. And no, we did you put the boom out down after treating the rust. And it's preventing any future rust. So it will save your floor from rust. And also while deadening sound. Now you can go back with say a vinyl and you still have that boom mat protection with a vinyl floor. And you can also, there is a uh, uh, match you can stick down under the vinyl that would further insulate its heat. But if you're in a colder climate, the Jeep heater probably would keep up with the cold unless you're in like subarctic temperatures, which I don't even know what the Jeep would start then. You probably wouldn't have one of these. <laughs> probably not. Yeah. But. Yeah, so it is a good product and it's very inexpensive for what you get. And with that note, if you were watching this and you got super hungry, go check out our recipes. 
she just replete she just released this really yummy cabbage steaks oh they are awesome Oh yeah, those are good. Mm. No, I won't. I was a very picky eater before you met me. So I changed it. They're very good, and uh, also there's a hundred. There's a getting up to 170 recipes out there, so you could find what your fits your taste. If you like this video. Hit the like button. It's down there. Looks like that. Probably doesn't mean any much anymore since they disable dislikes. But in any way, if you like our channel and want to see more stuff we create, subscribe. <laughs> and y'all please take care. Bye guys. Done, done, and done.